Hey guys, Zoga here, bringing you another video. In today's video, we're going over the Brewfest Chow Dome Trophy Toy. Uh, you get this by winning five of these con sausage eating contests. Um, so, here you always want to start off by doing one, one, two. Um, you'll see the three buttons in this are eat, um, brew, and platter. So, you want to eat all the sausages on your plate. It alternates between three, four, to five sausages. Your brews uh, reduce your choking point, allowing you to eat more. And you'll notice this little energy bar in the middle. If it gets to 100, your character is going to start choking like that character is in the middle. Um, and then it kind of freezes you up a little bit. Uh, you don't want to do that. It's going to slow you down. But I do see strategies that I did win. Uh, this is like my 30th, 50th, 40th one, where people just choke and then they just go ham on their necks. They, they wait 10 seconds and they just eat the whole platter. Um, but on this, I was testing numbers and I just kind of wanted to show you one that I won. Um, the sweet point you want is not letting it, when you have about 70 or below energy to eat, that way you can guarantee yourself you're not going to choke. And then you want to start off maybe with the one one two, and then one one, and then as you go, you'll you'll just kind of use your brew off cooldown. It does start with three charges, but you'll go through them pretty fast. Um, you're gonna notice that each those numbers indicates how many platters you've ate. Once you're at your ninth platter and you're asking for your tenth, um, or once you're finished with your tenth and you ask for it, that is when it uh, finishes. Um, so the first one who, first character who completes, eats 10, wins. And let's go over some strats and more details. Okay, guys. I couldn't go, like, over it all in that brief clip. Um, there are, like, I tested this a lot, and you, you'll see Wildhead comments. Um, obviously... For winning, you're going to get a Chowdown Champion token. You win five of these. Um, you can buy the toy, which is just a cool mug. We'll bust it out after towards the end of the video. I had the timer up because I was testing some things, but I, it might be bugged. But we'll go over it a little bit. Obviously, like I said, you want to start off by eating uh, twice and then using your brew. I even won some using my brew first and have it on cooldown. Let's see, well, you could watch this. Um, anyway, it, it is really just RNG, and it does get frustrating. Um, I wanted to make this point. I'm going to do a further video on the whole brew fest, but kind of want to get uh, this toy out of the way, sort of, because the RNG is frustrating. I did some numbers, and I broke down video by video of just rewatching and counting how many sausages each person was allowed to eat. So in that last video, I was meant to win. I did slow up at the end. Um, I choked on purpose, as you would see in the previous clip. Um, just to see how many uh, sausages were on the platter uh, for the last guy, I believe, on the very right. Um, but in total, I was only given 40 sausages. The person on my left was given 44. The person on my uh, right was given 41. And the person on my very right was given 42. So, yes, there is RNG involved. So, you could be just doing this, doing this, and you're not doing anything wrong. You're just getting screwed by Blizzard on that portion. Or you can be blessed. Um, another tip I would get is get friends. I mean, friends, you can compete against them. But also, there's no guarantee, because you do need four people to start this. Um, so, you can plausibly get a group of four and have them throw and just alternate wins. Another tip is 
once you enter, I, you have to go behind. Once you enter and you know you're about to lose, you're getting really bad RNG. Really bad RNG. This will start with a fourth person going. Actually, it will actually start now. Oh, see, it's bugged. This is great. We're, we don't even have four and it started. So this is a good example. I do not know how to start it. Um, but sometimes it will be bugged like that where you could just enter in and get a free win. Um, I was able to, to do that twice for someone just testing it. And I couldn't really pinpoint a timing on it. Anyway, like I was saying, if you know you're about to lose, uh, just use the little red arrow exit and leave. So that way, if there's it's packed, you don't get a three-minute cooldown of a full stomach. You will get that if you win or if you stay till the end. So avoid the debuff. Leave. Um, that way, you could just keep going. And I would try to do this in prime time. Prime slot times, you know, four, five, six on the weekend. So just get this done with when people are doing this in the beginning. Because people are going to be doing this either in the beginning and or towards the very, very end. Just uh, hurry up and try to get everything at the end. Um, so, yeah, those are my tips. I, again, try to be around under 75, 70 uh, full for, so you don't choke before you eat again. And if you just keep doing that method, and if RNG is on your side, uh, you will eventually win five. Or if you find three friends, um, that will also help. And this is the toy you get. It just gets you drunk as a skunk. Well, guys, thank you for watching. Enjoy. Try not to, you know punch your hands when someone's giving three sausages and you're getting five. Thank you and have a great day.